someone uses your material online, you have no special rights at all. A person uses your material for education, for news reporting, for parody, and several of the protected areas of, well, freedom of speech, basically, freedom of expression. And you could file a DMCA, but if you ever went to court, you wouldn't get anywhere. You would fail because of fair use. And if you upload your video that a person's responding to, documentary or not, professional work or simple vlog, it's still not protected. You put it on a public site for public viewership and you lose most of your protection. If someone stole a video off your hard drive or on a private YouTube channel with all the videos private and they hacked you and got your videos and then responded to them, that would be a different story. But we're not talking about private videos. We're not talking about restricted videos. We're talking about public videos on public display. And therefore, public rights apply. Just because you don't like a person's response, how a person responds to you, what they might say about you and about your work, your poorly thought out scientific claims, your poorly thought out philosophical ideas, just because you don't like that doesn't mean automatically you gain extra rights because you're butthurt. And that's the problem. Too many people think they have extra rights just because they feel offended. Offence gives you nothing. It doesn't give you extra rights. How could it? You don't get anything extra from it. You simply have what you have. And you have the right to query things, yes, you have the right to respond to things. But if you're uploading material onto websites or placing blogs on public sites, you don't actually have the ability to really carry out a copyright claim when a person uses parts of your material. I think really the only time you have any kind of rights in that regard is when plagiarism is involved. A person takes your documentary and they upload it to their own channel and claim it's their own. Or they take your blog, you know, your detailed article on a particular issue, put it onto their own and then put their own name as the name of the author. Just simply replicating your work word for word. There's a massive difference between plagiarism and actually doing a response to someone's work. 